Are we ready? Play! Good pass. Nice try. Right, so today's session, we're going to be working on 2v2s. We're going to start with our ball mastery, OK, in this area here. So as you can see, it should replicate that on the pitch. You've got four squares on the outside and one square in the middle. Dotted around those squares are some orange cones. See them? Yeah. yeah. Now these are going to be your ball manipulation cones. Okay. okay. Yeah. So on those cones, you're going to be using your inside outside, yeah. sole rolls, V drags, and then in our turning squares, which are these ones here, we're going to be using step over inside. What's that also known as sometimes? Hoddle. Squeeze turn and inside cut. All right? Everyone happy with that? Yeah. So in here, the rules are this. Listen in. You cannot be on the same line as one of your teammates, OK? So the same colour shouldn't be on the same line. You can move outside players anywhere around the outside. OK, so you can rotate like Josh and Harry just done. Once you've made your turn and your ball manipulation, can you play a nice pass to the outside? Can you give me a demo, Char? So a little squeeze turn in there. Lovely bit of ball manipulation. Now you're going to get your head up and find a pass. When you do your turn, I'm looking for an explosion of pace. Get in, get out. When you're doing your ball manipulation, it's about the number of touches you get, not how quickly you can get from cone to cone, okay? So it's slightly different. Nice, good touches. Big angles on your outside, inside. All right? Off you go. Yeah, Love that pace, Barnaby. Love it. And freeze there. If you're in the middle, just stay there. OK, next one. In the turning square, we're going to be using our step over inside. Barn, can you give me a demo, please? Love the scan before you turn. Well done. On the orange cones now, your ball manipulation is going to be a sole roll stop, OK? Can you give me another demo? Good, it's a nice change of feet. Off we go. Yeah, hurry, hurry, hurry. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Make the player in the middle get his head up. Make him get his head up, keep moving. If someone's in the same square as you, Char, go and find another one, all right? It's a great pass, Char. It's a great pass. Make sure you scan before you do your move. Just think about the type of pass the player on the outside wants to receive. He wants to be able to take a good first touch straight into being able to do his turn and then his ball manipulation. So in the air, you're making it a little bit harder for him. So can you keep it on the floor? In here, as well as your turns and your ball manipulation, what needs to be better? What needs to be good? What? You need to scan, you need to get your head up. These players on the outside are making it hard for you because they're constantly moving, which, which we want. So make sure you keep scanning. OK, next one. Inside cut in the turning square. Can you do it for me, Ash? OK, and our ball manipulation is now going to be a V-drag. OK, can you show me one? Any V drag you like. Good, so it was so outside. You can do two if you want. If you want to change direction twice, two's the limit, though. Play. In here now, you can do a variety of any of those turns and ball manipulations. Up to you. Okay. When we now play onto the outside, 
I've just done my little ball manipulation. Okay, I'm just about to play to the outside if I'm a red. We're just going to give our partner a little angle and a little bounce pass and take his place. And hold it there. Okay, so what was the focus there? In there? Ball manipulation and turns. Ball manipulation and turns. Then we, as we went on, as we progressed, we progressed a little bit into some more. What did we add in? Play. Some different combinations. Okay, so they're all useful in a 2v2 situation.